What's going on, fam? It is your favorite archer from Noah Base and Mental back with another Amalgamite, another fusion character. And in this video, we have one of my absolute favorites because there is a movie coming out about one half of this character, and it comes out today, February 26th, which is the day I'm recording this. I wanted to have it uploaded by today, but things ain't line up, so when you see this, this is when it will be uploaded. And the movie that is coming out today is My Hero Academia Heroes Rising. And I'm such a fan of the show. I'm such a fan of the series. So of course, I had to take my favorite character, which is Izuku Midoriya, AKA Deku. And I had to combine him with Yusuke Yurameshi, an old classic from one of my favorite series ever, Yu Yu Hakusho. It goes down in history as to me as one of the best series ever. It was very ironic and I didn't think about it that, that their colors are green. It took me a second and I was like, oh snap, I'm gonna have to come up with something. But then I remember you, uh, Yusuke's colors were like gold and like a, a, I wanna say a violet blue when he fought Tagora. So I ran with that for the color scheme of the combined character, Izuke Yudori. I thought it sounded pretty cool. And his hero name, I decided to be Mazaku. If you know the history of Yu Yu Hakusho, you know at the end of the series, spoiler alert if you have it, Yusuke becomes a demon that's a hybrid that can pass down his genes to a worthy host. And in Izuku's case, he received his abilities from All Might. His ability is called One for All. And it's a stockpiling quirk because in My Hero Academia, they have quirks that are basically abilities, special powers that they use to be superheroes. But everyone, at least 80% of the population, has them. Deku, Deku, in this case, was born without them. And All Might gave him those powers. But I decided to combine them because of the way the Mazaku is passed down and the way One for All is passed down. This ability is literally the same as it is in more so in My Hero Academia. Is a pass down uh, ability that has that grows with energy and grows in, with its use and becomes much more powerful the further it's passed down. With the Mazaku combination of the ability, it's only passed down to a worthy host. The criteria is up in the air at the moment. For uh, Izuke, or Izuke, um, he happened to be the eighth wielder of the ability of the power, like Deku. He didn't have any powers at the beginning of his journey. Where the whole one for all pass down part comes in. You can pass the Mazaku ability on to people who aren't in the gene pool. You can even talk to previous wielders of the, the, uh, the Mazaku power. And you can talk to the previous uh, Mazaku wielders, but you cannot get their abilities. And in this case, because of the Yusuke half of this character, he developed very strong spiritual powers and uh, powers you know, that allows him to focus and control his energy into a spirit gun and a shotgun and many other spirit wave and a few other techniques to help bolster his strength, bolster his power, get control of his abilities and to get control of, get control of at least eight or nine generations of a growing ability. Is there anything else I need to say? Oh, if there's another Mazaku that is alive that can overpower this, this current Mazaku's will, they can take control of them and use them to fight. And if you've seen Yu Yu Hakusho at the end of the series, that's exactly what Yusuke's new father does. So I wanted to implement that into it as well. You know, like, if they're still alive, they can still hack the power, but they can hack that person. They can't use the abilities themselves. This ability allows for a crazy amount of super strength, just like in My Hero and allowed him to basically use the wind as a weapon. Depending on if the body is ready or not ready for that energy, it can tear the body apart. So it requires them to heal. And if it does too much damage, it can even break the spirit. And if you made it this far in the video, I appreciate all of your support. Keep coming back to visit. Just do me a favor. Make sure you like, you comment, you share, and you subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell. Like after this, you might want to get notified because I'm uploading the Two Heroes movie. I might even do another review on the previous My Hero Academia movie. Just because 
is My Hero Academia. Like I have all like first three seasons on DVD. Absolutely love it. So make sure you're checking out my other Amalgamites. There are quite a few. There are quite a few more coming. But they are both some badass characters to me. Like I'm a fan of Yusuke and Izuku. I am just a fan. I love these characters. I had fun making him. Really enjoy making this character. Oh my gosh, so much fun. I really enjoyed it. I know it don't seem like it because we're artists and artists are like a little different, but I really enjoy, like, love this character. I hope you all enjoy it as well. And I just need one thing from you, just one thing. Please make sure you drop characters you would love to see combined. They do not have to be all anime. They do not have to all be fiction. They can also be real. I love the challenge. I really do. I'm having a lot of fun doing this. I know I'm asking for so many things. Just one more thing though. And you should exercise your excuses and go create. All right fam, it is your favorite entrepreneur Vasa Mental and I will see you in the next video. Nothing but love. Or I'll just see you in the next video. Peace.